Hi guys, it's Lorenzo from Atom Music Studio and today I'm going to show you how to create a lo-fi wobbling effect just using stock plugins in Logic. For uh, this example, I'm going to recreate the Kill Bill intro by Caesar. Okay, let's start with uh, creating a new MIDI track and loading the desired sound. In my case, I'm going to load the Mellotron plugin. Choose your favorite sound. In this case, I'll use the strings and flute preset changing the parameters to be as close as possible to the original sound. So blend at 83, tip speed at minus 4 and tone at 38. Now you're ready to wobble it using the tape delay in Logic. So go to the audio effect list, delay, tape delay. First thing to do is to set your delay time to 0 milliseconds in order to have the sound not delayed but just modulated as we will see in a few seconds and to do so unsync the delay clicking on the tempo sync here and then put the delay time to zero milliseconds doing this uh, you will have no delay at all and uh, change the output uh, dry to zero percent and uh, the wet to 100 percent and uh, now it's time to wobble our sound, so go to the modulation tab and change the LFO rate and LFO intensity to your liking. For uh, this example, I'm gonna set the LFO rate to 1.54Hz and uh, I choose this value for a very, very simple reason. Uh, the original intro sound in the cable wobbles uh, at a value of a quarter note and the closest value in the LFO rate in logic to a quarter note is uh, 1.54 Hz. And then put the LFO intensity percentage to 25%. To have uh, this wobbling effect very subtle but very very effective. So let's have a listen. Uh, before without the tape delay. And now with the tape delay on it. Once you've done this, process your sound as you wish, EQing, compressing and so on. But remember one thing, if you're creating a layer of sounds, copy the tip delay on every channel strip to have the best result possible because this will give to the general sound the same coherent effect. Here are my effects, EQ and another EQ. And for the full intro, we also need the harmony made with uh, the same Mellotron preset done before and uh, an electric piano and uh, with the process this is how my Killbill intro remake sounds okay we are done i hope this was helpful for you Remember to subscribe to the channel and if you're interested in Ableton Live or Logic Pro projects, templates or remakes, just check out my website. Uh, you will find the link down below in the description. And uh, see you soon.